The late Jurassic was a realm ruled by giants, and at the heart of this empire stood not a single apex predator, but an entire dynasty, the Allosauridae. Their fossils, scattered across the Morrison Formation and beyond, reveal a lineage engineered for dominance. With lightweight yet powerful skulls, recurved serrated teeth, strong forelimbs tipped with lethal claws, and muscular bodies balanced by long tails, these predators embodied the pinnacle of Jurassic lethality. Their slash and tear method of attack distinguished them from later bone crushers like T-Rex, showcasing a specialized strategy built for felling enormous prey. But this dynasty was far from uniform. Multiple massive predators inhabited the same landscape, raising a fundamental ecological puzzle. How could so many apex hunters coexist? The answer lies in niche partitioning. Allosaurus fragilis, the most common species, was agile and mid-sized, preying on Stegosaurus, Camptosaurus, and especially the abundant juvenile sauropods. In contrast, the colossal Saurophaganax maximus, stretching over 11 meters, was built for tackling the largest adult sauropods giants few others dared to challenge. Their coexistence likely extended beyond prey selection, involving subtle differences in habitat preference, with each species occupying distinct zones within the vast Jurassic floodplains. Yet these boundaries were never absolute. Overlapping territories, contested kills, and scarce resources would have sparked violent confrontations where size and power dictated dominance. The fossil record preserves the brutal reality of their world. The famous Big Al, a subadult Allosaurus, bears 19 injuries, broken ribs, damaged vertebrae, and a crippling foot infection. Signatures of desperate hunts, devastating blows from prey, or battles with rivals. His skeleton narrates a life of constant suffering in a landscape where even the strongest predators endured relentless physical punishment. Even more chilling is the Cleveland Lloyd Dinosaur Quarry, a predator trap where dozens of Allosaurus perished. Likely drawn to trapped herbivores, they themselves became mired in mud, triggering deadly competition and even cannibalism among desperate individuals. This site reveals a hierarchy enforced through violence, where the dynasty's own members were often the gravest threat. Together, these scars and mass death sites illuminate a world where dominance was never secure. The Allosaurids ruled not through peace, but through ceaseless struggle, an evolutionary crucible that shaped the Jurassic ecosystem and left behind a legacy carved into bone.